Hello, and welcome to Auto of the Future. Anyone can fly from anywhere to anywhere at any time, pushing the boundaries of one-call transportation and realizing the full meaning of urban air mobility. We define Voler as a new mode of transportation, a UAM aircraft for individual use. Voler will investigate all intracity commuting possibilities, as well as future lifestyles. Last month, Bellwether Industries, a UK-based urban air mobility, or UAM, completed the first test flight of its two-seat Voler eVTOL aircraft prototype in Dubai. The test flight was able to log eight test flights with its half-scale model during the session, which is a significant achievement for the team, which has now completed a year of indoor tethered flights. The Voler is a tiny vehicle with a hidden propulsion system that is aimed at the private urban aircraft market for intracity transport, according to the eVTOL developer. The completed plane will be 3.2 meters or 10.5 feet wide, roughly 1.5 meters or 5 feet broader than a typical vehicle. According to Lin which is the co-founder of Bellwether, the vehicle doesn't look like an aircraft, so when people see it, they don't see how it could work or how it could fly, but it's real. Through the first test flight, Lin said, the company has been able to demonstrate the vehicle's controllability. Bellwether is a newer startup than some of the biggest participants in the eVTOL field, having been founded in 2019 by four college friends. Lin and co-founder Daniel Chen began exploring in the space in 2013, when they began developing the Gazelle, their first hovercraft, which debuted at the International Young Designers Exhibition in Taipei, Taiwan in 2015. Lin explained that they made the model hover but couldn't get it to fly because it was too heavy. That was a key milestone for the team in establishing this idea of flying vehicles. They continued to develop the concept before heading to the United Kingdom to start a new project with a larger crew than established the business. Until far, the startup has kept its project a secret, but it recently chose to make public appearances at the DroneX Trade Show and Air Taxi World Congress this fall, as well as the Dubai Air Show in November, where its aircraft was first exhibited to the public. These public appearances are critical milestones in attracting investors for the company's next seed round. Bellwether said, it needs to raise an undisclosed amount of money in addition to the 1 million US dollars it got from angel investors last year to develop a full-scale functioning prototype with integrated subsystems and grow its engineering team. The current prototype is a two-seat EV toll, but Bellwether expects the ultimate vehicle to be a four- or five-seat aircraft capable of transporting families across congested cities. The prototype was remotely flown during the test flight and soared up to 4 meters or 13 feet at a speed of roughly 40 kilometers per hour or 25 miles an hour. The final design, according to the business, will be able to cruise at heights of up to 915 meters or 3,000 feet, at speeds of 220 kilometers per hour or 135 miles per hour, and with a maximum takeoff weight of 600 kilograms or 1,320 pounds. Lin said the team is working on a fully electric VTOL, but Bellwether isn't ruling anything out just yet because the Voler is still in its early phases of development. He stated that the company is aiming for a battery system that can run for 60 to 90 minutes and be used for intracity trips. Bellwether is also looking on various business models, such as an air traffic management system and UAM infrastructure, in addition to designing the aircraft. Lin stated that the firm plans to bring the Voler to market in 2028, and that the company is working closely with consultants to prepare for its type certification application with the European Union Aviation Safety Agency and the United Kingdom. Though Lin stated that the EV toll's initial pricing will be like owning a private jet in 2030, he hopes to reduce that price over the next decade to make it equivalent to buying a vehicle. Bellwether believes, like other technology industries, as the UAM industry evolves and more companies enter the space, technology and mass production will mature, lowering the price point over time. The goal of the company is to make the vehicle for everyone in the future like owning a car. Please do not forget to hit like, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more content about automobile of the future. Thank you for watching.